Well, I believe that she exists. Last year, Irma Moreno ran for a seat on the Roosevelt School District's governing board. She won with more than 5,000 votes and then disappeared. Where is this money going? The question tonight, where has Irma Moreno gone? This is her during an interview a few years ago. Since November's election, Moreno has missed every meeting. In fact, she's never been sworn in. Tracy Benson with the county superintendent's office says this is the first time she's ever seen this happen. We've tried to reach her by phone and, and letter, um, and we just haven't had any luck being in touch with her. Moreno's campaign paperwork says she's a housewife who lives at this address. When we went by, no one was home and no one answered the phone. Yes, you just reach uh, Joe Martinez. Uh, I'm unable to get to the phone. Joel Martinez told the Arizona Republic he used to be engaged to Moreno until she left in November. He claims to have filed a missing persons report. Phoenix police doesn't have one on file. These neighbors say they haven't seen Moreno since December when she was supposed to drive one of them to work. I'm appalled by it. Benson says her office is working to replace Moreno. If she doesn't surface soon, the Arizona Constitution says... Then the person who previously held the position can, can basically hold over and continue in that role until the next election. And if that former member declines and the seat remains empty, someone will be appointed to fill it. Meanwhile, the school board tells me that it has not had a vote that was split right down the, me the middle among its four current members, meaning that Moreno's vote up until now would not have made a difference. Reporting live in Phoenix, Karina Sun, 3TV.